The Marlins have had a strong start to the season on the mound, with a team ERA of 3.40, which is 6th best in baseball. Marlins pitching holds opposing hitters to the 7th lowest team of batting average at 222. The Marlins starting pitcher Pablo Lopez has been below par in each of the last two starts, but has held opposing teams to one earned run or less in 6 of 10 starts so far this year, and he has a stellar 2.04 ERA, which is 8th best in baseball. The Rockies, suffering from poor performances on the mound, as Colorado are next to last in Team ERA with a 5.04 and last in Team Whip with 1.48. Opposing hitters are teeing off on Rockies pitching to the tune of 280, which is also last in baseball. How could you not go with, my, how could you not go with Miami here? Total has finished over in four of Miami's last five played on the road and in six of the last nine that the Marlins have played on grass. Overall, the total has finished over in seven of Miami's last 11. Rockies, worst team ERA in all of baseball, 5.04, and opposing hitters, averaging 280 at the plate against Colorado pitching, which is also last in baseball, makes this an easy over. Two plays we're going to go with. We're going Miami Marlins, and we're also going to go Miami Colorado, over 10. What say you? Let me know in the comment section. Interested to hear your take. Taylor Fade, may the winner be yours. Good luck, gang. Go get them. This is... Trending Rabbit.